Hey family, welcome back to my channel, The Pisces Way. A place for a Pisces made just for a Pisces. Sun, moon, and rising. And you already know, it's your girl, her people smart. And you already know how we do. So sit back and relax. And we're definitely going to get the tea for the Pisces, okay? Cross watch is definitely welcome. Wherever you might have Pisces placements as well. Higher power, archangels, ancestors, gods, and goddesses of the divine white light. Please protect me and my family as we dip into this read. Please protect our energy from any unwanted souls, lives, or entities. Please give us the clarity and the truth. Please surround us with your love and guide us with your wisdom, always and forever. High power, archangels, ancestors of the divine white light, showing gratitude and thanks for all the blessings, the lessons, the seasons, and new beginnings. Be delivering us away from temptation, guiding us throughout our journey to the motherland of milk and honey. Forever grateful for your divine protection and love. Amen. Now with that being said, let's tap in. Okay. So let's see what's going on, family. I feel like somebody wants you to be in this promiscuous energy or have wanted you to be in this promiscuous energy for as long as they have known you, okay? This person always wanted you to be of the darkness and not the light, okay? They wanted you to have these burns, these... um. They want you to just be promiscuous. They want you to do things you're not proud of. Or they want you to be how, I don't know. I'm not going to say if they, how they are because I don't know if this person is like this. But, like, if you're a woman, they basically want you to be a hoe. If you're a man, they basically want you to be a gigolo. Like, they didn't want you to have love or be in love. This person wanted you to be damaged, broken. Um, always feeling like somebody's out to get them. Um, always feeling like you know you gotta one up an individual or get them before they get you or there's not real trustworthy people out in the world like somebody just wanted to really ruin your deception like kind of take over this and like this person could have been doing things on purpose to actually hurt you or damage you or, or doing shit behind the scenes that they knew were going to hurt your feelings or hurt you in some kind of way they they wanted to do it on purpose though because this person wanted to like damage you they wanted you to be damaged goods okay pisces they didn't want you to um i'm also hearing they have no remorse like they don't want you to have remorse either or they didn't want you to have remorse when you were doing whatever you were doing it's like oh i don't i don't want pisces to care i don't want you to have feelings i just wanted you to do it you know and didn't give a fuck who got hurt in the middle or, or didn't give a fuck who Suffer because of it, okay, Pisces? They wanted you to be this way. I don't... Let's see what's going on. What is this? I'm getting like somebody here wants to cause as many blockages in your life as possible, Pisces. Just simple point blank. Um... If, if it led to prosperity, if it led to money, if it led to happiness, they didn't care which which way. Okay, something about a back alley as well. Somebody could be in a back alley or around a corner in the back alley. Like, somebody could be stay watching you from, like, a back alley or from doing some creepy, weird-ass shit. I don't know what this is. Um, but it's something about this person wanted to, like, sink your battleship. Like, if you were on a road to success or if you was on a road to doing something, um, making some type of milestone in your life here, this person wants to cause them as many burdens as possible. I do feel like this is a man, okay? Um, but take it how it resonates. But I'm getting, like, if this is not a man, then this is, like, a spouse, like, somebody you were in a relationship. But I'm getting specifically, like, I could be talking to a divine feminine and there's a man here, Okay? This person didn't, didn't want you to make it, okay? This, this person didn't want you to sail across shore or sail into happiness or, or to be something here or to manifest something. Somebody's also um, afraid of what you can manifest or what you can um, what you can do with your manifestation gills. Uh, gills? Okay, Pisces. Again, again with swimming. For some of you guys, it's giving this car. You, you could have walked away from this individual. You could have left this individual out in the dust, okay? You could have um, seen something that you don't like about this person and you walked away from them. Um, you were very cautious of this individual. I'm also getting like you didn't tell this person why you were walking away. You just kind of walked away, okay, Pisces? Um, you didn't let them know shit. But for some, like, but like I said, for some of you guys, you didn't have to. This person already kind of knew because... 
you're intuitive so you caught on to whatever that was going on here yeah i do feel like this is a person that walked away from you but this individual uh, or you walked away from but this individual um is in your energy now if if this person walked away from you it was the energy of they thought that you were going to chase them okay so they may have walked away for some of you guys but they kept looking back this person never really left they kept looking back to see if you were going to chase them if you were going to be behind them if you were going to be waiting for them at the altar because that's what i'm hearing be me at the altar yeah somebody here could want to propose or marry you they could even have wanted to um marry you like when you are, are like the, i don't know or you could have wanted to marry an individual okay take care of resonate whether this was a relationship or like some engagement or whatever this was here somebody wa you walked away somebody walked away either way it go i feel like pisces you're the one who stayed away okay yeah i heard swimming with the fishes I'm, I'm, I'm getting like, you could care less what this person got going on in their life, okay? I'm also getting like, this person like, don't exist to you. I'm not going to say dead to me, even though that energy is, get, if that's what it's giving. Like, you know, people are like, oh, you're dead to me. I'm not, I'm not getting that. It's giving this, okay? The eight of cups. I'm not really getting that, though. I'm not really getting like that, um... Dead to me. I'm sorry, guys. My nose is like, it gets stopped up sometimes when I'm doing the readings. Um, But I'm not really getting like that dead to me because I don't, I don't feel like you want this person to pass. Like, not intentionally. Like, I just feel like you wouldn't wish that on a person, okay? But it's more of an energy. Like, you you really could care less what this person got going on. You, you could really care less if you ever see this individual again. Oh, uh, yeah, but this person wants to stunt your growth. They want to stock, uh, stop you. Stocky. Somebody could be stocky. Somebody could be thick. Somebody could have wanted you to be fat here. Three of swords. There was some type of heartbreak energy or somebody's in some, somebody's feelings are hurt or crushed here about the fool. You take it some type of leap of faith to go maybe in some type of opposite direction here. Or you, you're trusting your instinct, okay? So, this person here also wanted to project onto you, Pisces. They wanted to project onto you feelings and emotions. Um, you know, like, different feelings and emotions. You know, have you be afraid of certain things? Have you be in some type of barrier? Like I said, this, could, this person could have been a lot of different shit to you. But this person wanted you to be afraid of moving forward. Um, are falling through with something here it's the energy of like you looking the other way when it comes to and again you looking up look at that that motherfucker over there drowning again it, it's you looking the other way because see with the five of cups this person wastes your cups here you didn't waste your own cups they waste your cups and now that this motherfucker is flowing downstream you could really care less it's not i'm getting 0333 yeah, 333 could be significant, but I meant 0833, okay? But 333 could be significant. Empress energy, okay? Take out of a resume, but I'm getting like you're looking the other way when it comes to something. This person could even be needing your help. This person uh, needs your help or they want your help or they want something from you here. And they could be in their feelings because you refuse to help them. You refuse to answer their call. You refuse to be by them, by their side in any kind of way. This is somebody, it's like time you get in that water and try to help them. You could have always been trying to help this person. Or you could have always had their back or, or tried to lead them down the wrong path. I mean, right down the right path. Even though they tried to lead you down the wrong path. Or even though they did shit on purpose to hurt you, you still didn't hold no animosity. Or you still didn't hold, you know, no regret for this, this individual. Somebody could be dealing with an emperor. Okay, um, or you could be an emperor, emperor energy here. I'm also hearing emperor, empress. I'm hearing hit me with your best shot, fire away. For some of you guys, this person could be trying to target your spouse. 
okay whoever you are in a relationship with um this person could be trying to target your spouse this person could be trying to um throw shots at them or come at them in some kind of way about about something here put them on blast or outcast them or make them look silly or make them look a fool here they can even be energetically um in your your person's energy at this time pisces this person's trying to get clarity on some type of knock. Somebody could be confused about what you got going on, who you who you're um, taking a risk with, or what you're taking a risk on. But this person do know that you got something big coming up in your energy. This person wants to find a way to self sabotage this. Whoever this is, this person has been a bear. This person has been a burden for a while, Pisces. Like you have just. I'm hearing an ego death. They're having an ego death. This person has been in your energy and has been a burden for a while. Like, literally. Like, this person has been stalking you. They have been trying to compromise you, compromise your connection, or compromise somebody you might be crushing on or that's crushing on you. They've been just, like, a real burden. Like, this person has just been... But that is their plan. They're supposed to make your life as hard as possible. But whoever you are, you just keep pushing, Pisces. You just keep going on and on. I, I feel like life has always been kind of hard or you have always faced challenges. Okay, but I feel like this has never stopped you. Whoever you are, this has never stopped you. That's why you have a, vic a victory coming. And I'm, a, I'm also getting like this is a real victory here. Not a victory with fake motherfuckers in the crowd. This is a real victory here. You're going to shine. And I'm also hearing night and shining armor. Yeah, somebody here is crying at night. This individual who wants to cause these blockages. Yep, Ten of Cups. You're going to have a family, a real family. So for some of you guys, this is somebody you were supposed to have a family with or you could have had children with. Yeah, your heart will be mended here. Things that this person has done to you in the past, you will forget about it. Okay? You 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 will forget about this individual. You will no longer be in this in energy of wondering what they're doing, who they're with, or or what they got going on. You won't even give a fuck. Okay, again, like I said, but I'm getting like to the end. so if this is somebody you have children with, this is what I'm getting, y'all. Like you are this person won't exist in your mind anymore. Like it's like they'll vanish or some shit. Like, you will never see them again. Or they'll be in jail or for some of them, they might just, you know, okay, they might just, bloop, I don't know, you know. Or, or for some of you guys, they might go to jail or, or something might happen where you just might not see this person no more. It's the energy of, like, never having to look back or never having to be curious or never having to wonder. It's like this person will be there standing, but it's like you're... You're off on a new adventure here. I'm here. I'm hot. I'm off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. So the wizard of Oz could be significant here. We got the Ace of Wands though, and all of these are coming out together here. Somebody wants brand new, brand new connections, brand new clarity. It's like no way I'm going back to this person. No way I'm going back to this devil. No way I'm going back to this toxicity. No way I'm going back to this environment. What you put me through. Um. Yeah, for some of you guys, yeah, Hierophant. Look, the Hierophant was um, switched around. You learned your lesson. You want nothing to do with this individual. But I'm getting like, this Hierophant here is showing his hand, okay? It's, it's the energy of not being stingy. It's not, oh, I will teach you. Not only will I teach you, but I will show you. You want to put something on display for everybody to see. Yep. And I'm also getting what's also coming along with this nine of wands is it's a little promiscuousness, okay? But in a good way. So for some of you guys, you have like this energy about yourself where you could like to get in a little trouble or you could like to be a little rebellion, but in a good way, okay? But it's the energy of like you getting away with some shit, but it's not hurting anybody. Like you're not going to be the type of individual that's going out and hurting individuals or um you know um okay hold on give me one second okay 
So it's the energy of like not only just um it's the energy of like with this hyphen being here, not only just um, you know, putting something on display or telling others about it, but showing as well. Okay. Putting something on display in a different way. That's the play. Just show, you know, being able to show somebody. I'm also getting an energy with the book here. Somebody could be writing a book or telling a story here. But it's the energy of, like, not being stingy. Um, but not necessarily. I'm getting, like, with your wisdom or or with your knowledge. It's like, well, if anybody went at you, well, how did you know? How do you know the knowledge that you know? How do you, um, how are you so intuitive or how do you been through the things you've been through or how, what made you or how did you, you know, rebuild after this? How did you start over? Um, it's the energy of like being able to sit down and tell, tell your tale. Okay. Yeah. Eight, eight of pentacles here. And I'm also getting energy of being safe and secure about it as well. Okay. Being trust, being truthful and trusting. Like, I'm getting like being okay and confident within yourself. Walking away with victory and knowing it's gonna be a victory. It's like I don't have to sit here and watch it. I know it's gonna grow. Okay, I know it will build here because you know that this is a blessing from the divine. Okay, we got Queen of Cups coming out. Oh, Nine of Cups. Sorry, but I was getting a Queen of Cups energy. Queen of Cups can be significant, but it don't have to be. Whether this could be you or somebody you have in mind, but I was it's the Nine of Cups, which could be any blessing, okay? Some type of gift here, giving and receiving, a reward of some sort for all your stuff that you went through. Look at that Queen of Cups fell out. So for some of you guys, it definitely is the Queen of Cups energy. Some of you guys, you were dealing with an individual who worshiped the devil, okay? Now, if you are this queen of cups here, this is you getting a brand new love. Or this is you having love for yourself, cherishing yourself. I'm also getting like, there's a queen of cups here that is very fucking stingy. Okay? Yeah, there's a queen of cups here that is very stingy. Five of pentacles. I'm getting like this person could have left you out in the cold, or you left this individual out in the cold. This person uh, was supposed to be offering or supposed to be sharing something for with you or for you, but this person um, ended up. Yeah, I'm here. Yes, I'm saving all my love for you. Like, I'm getting like, if this person was supposed to save something for you or cherish you or put you in some type of high honor, this person did it. Um, if this was like a mother here, this is somebody who was supposed to nurture you, be there for you, love you unconditionally, and they did it. Okay, five of wands. This person created a lot of conflict in your life. This person created a lot of barriers. Or like I said, if now, if you are a, a woman here... This could be you who is turning your back on this individual. Maybe once upon a time you did have love for somebody. Okay, you did want to be with somebody. But now I feel I feel like with the page of Pentacles coming out in reverse, you have closed that book, you closed that chapter. You already see what's there and you mm, it's it's the energy of like throw throw the whole damn book away. It's like I see what's there and I'm I'm pretty much I'm cool on it, okay? Yeah, this person is just full of drama and toxicity. This is somebody who always wants to argue with you, who um, swear up and down you're wrong or, or flip the script on you some kind of way here. This person likes to point the finger. I'm also getting abandonment issues. Somebody could have been abandoned as a child or this is you are abandoned in a time of need and this could have triggered something here. Somebody was abandoned. Or this could be somebody literally abandoning 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 sorry abandoning your, uh, <laughs> a child of yours like if you guys have children together this person could have abandoned your child in some type of time of need when they were supposed to be there the most yeah somebody plays the victim a lot 
Somebody pays the victim a lot, okay? They throw rocks, they hide their hand, and then they cry about it. They pay the victim, they whine about it, okay? I'm also getting like this person makes simple tasks look so hard. It, it don't even supposed to be hard, but they make it look so hard. Queen of Pentacles, somebody's finances went to a death here. Or, or something about somebody's finances with finances will be put to death. Okay, will be put there will be some type of ending. Or this could be somebody in this Queen of Pentacles energy. But it's not an energy of discovery, it's the energy of being selfish here, being greedy, indecisive, or withholding. Okay. Somebody is um I'm hearing something about a prostitution ring, okay? Somebody wanted to put a child up for adoption or wanted to put a child into some type of prostitution ring. Like, I'm here, God forbid, but if anything would have happened to you, this person would have done this to your child, maybe sold your child for money, or this person did sell a child for money here. I'm also here, I'm also here and steal a child. Somebody could have wanted to kidnap a child for money. Yeah, a magician with the five of wands. I'm getting like this person wants to stir up a whole bunch of trouble, okay? With you, they want to stir up a whole bunch of trouble, okay? Out of jealousy, spite, and envy. But I'm getting like they only stir up trouble with themselves and the law, okay? I'm hearing fight fire with fire, you get burned. Somebody wanted to, I'm getting though, like I don't get that you were um, fighting fire with fire. Somebody definitely could have been trying to aim at you because they felt like you were aiming at them in some kind of way. Like, oh, you hurt me, Pisces. You did this shit to me first, Pisces, or something like that. But you you were never being intentional about something. Or if you did, you tried to make up in some kind of way. This person couldn't let it go. They wanted their lick back. They wanted tip for tad. They wanted to be spiteful. Or it was the energy of this person. They just wanted to do what the fuck they wanted to do. They didn't care. They like, well, you sorry, but I don't give a fuck. This is somebody, I'm telling you, they gonna smile in your face. I'm here smiling in your face. Whole time they wanna take your place. Backstab us. Backstab us. Yeah, this person wants to stab you in the back because they want to be you. Whether this is a man or a woman, they wanted to be you. They had some type of great animosity for you. They wanted they lick back. They wanted they lick back for you being yourself. That shit is wild. And they could have... They were going to target anything or they did target anything that was close to you. So if it was family that you valued, they tag, they uh, targeted that. If it was children that you valued, they targeted that. If it was money that you valued, they targeted that. They, they targeted anything that, you know, made you smile or made you happy. If it was just like having joy in your heart, this person wanted you to be damaged and ruined. Yeah, they got a lot of people or ratted up a whole lot of people that's looking at them now and expecting them to take some type of lead here on some shit. Just looking at them like, why the fuck was we doing this in the first place? Like, what was this was all? What was this all about, really? And they're realizing it's because this person was jealous. It's like, you stirred up all this trouble, all this drama because you're jealous of Pisces. Like, you stirred, you did all this shit because you're jealous. Like, is you fucking for real? We going to jail and motherfuckers getting sick and motherfuckers dying and all kind of shit. You did all this because you're jealous. And this person just standing there in the middle like... No, because I want my revenge, or I want my revenge. But it's like, what revenge? Like, nobody did shit to you. <laughs> like, this person's delusional. This is just somebody that pays victim. It doesn't matter. You could have you could have just decided to be successful in life, or you could have just made some type of choice and decision here. It don't matter what you would have did. It don't matter if you... Play tit tat with this person or not in the past. It don't matter if you, you know, just was like, you know what, I'm done. You you win. It doesn't matter. This person was still going to find some type of way to fight with you or argue with you, Pisces. Yeah. And this person also could be, this person could also be coming in your dreams as well. Waking you up in the middle of the night around 2 to 2 to 5, okay, between those hours. 
But I'm getting like whatever lizard or entity that they're um conjuring up is being slayed here. I'm also getting the in the ancestors are fighting along with you as well. I'm also getting like your clarity is what's helping slaying these entities as well. Because you know what it is, you know who it is, and when you return that shit back to center, because you know exactly who's doing what, this is what's causing these motherfuckers to be in their head. Or this person to be in their head. This is one person, though. Now, I know my other reading was about multiple people. This is one individual. Yeah, this person was smiling in your face for a very long time. For years, even. There could definitely even be a mother figure involved, okay? A mother could have even wanted or an auntie. Okay, take out of that. I'm getting like this could be a, a ex-lover, a spouse, whether a man or a woman, or a mother. I'm not really getting a father. Or this is like some type of woman figure here. This person could be doing shit in the dream state. Page of Swords, yeah. Yeah, you got clarity on this shit. But you also got clarity that this person was teaming up with other people. You also got some help on the way, too. This person, they wanted you to self-sabotage yourself and not see it coming, okay? Then, they wanted 1144. And then they wanted you to beg them for help. Whoever was these people that they ganged up with. But it is about this one person here. I feel like this person was throwing shots, like, coming at you sideways, like, arguing with you. And then they start throwing real shots. Like, you know, doing shit behind the scenes to, like, hurt you and spite you. And, and like, I don't know. Doing magic at you. Or this person could have been physically trying to harm you or put their hands on you. Or put shit in your food. Or send people to hurt you or something like that. Yeah, something about this person's apology is phony. Whether they finna come towards you or they finna send somebody towards you, that's phony. But this energy of this person finna come towards you, it's phony. It's phony ass offer. Yeah. Somebody is stingy. They wanna take. They wanna take from you and wasted basically they basically want to just waste it here this you know why because this person doesn't have nothing to give or they don't have no inspiration to give into anything it's like you know how they be like um i'm here don't bring no don't don't breathe no life into this bitch i'm getting like it's like when you got when you give something life, this person, everything they touch dies, literally. They don't have no life to give to nothing. So it's like it's a waste. But they just want to take it from you because they don't want you to have it. Yep. Queen of Swords. Somebody could be dealing with a Queen of Swords or this is you. I feel like this is a um whether this is a man or a woman here, there is some type of Queen of Swords energy. If this is a man that they, they just act like a real Bitch, a real biatch. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> Somebody could be dealing with Aquarius, or you could be Aquarius, or have uh, Aquarius in your chart. Pisces. Yeah, this person, you could even thought this person was your friend. You didn't think that they would do something like what they were doing. Or you you thought you confided in this individual. Like you thought that you really, you know, they were trustworthy. No, nah, this motherfucker wasn't trustworthy. They were smiling in your face, but they whole time they wanted everything that was coming for you. And you might was looking around like, well, shit, I ain't even got much of shit. But it's like what's supposed to be coming for you. For some of you guys, it might not look like you got nothing because they've been trying to sabotage it. Or they've been coming in between it. That's the only reason why it might not look like it. But it's like, if you only knew what you're supposed to have right now, Pisces. If you only knew. 
urgent. Somebody's sweating. Yeah. Meditation. Because I'm getting like somebody here is in deep thought, deep meditation. Some urges. Somebody having urges here. April. Okay, somebody could be dealing with an Aries or a damn, um, we also got Capricorn here or a Sagittarius, an Aries or a Virgo. Ooh, Virgo. Somebody could be dealing with a Virgo. A Virgo could be significant. But an Aries or a, um, an Aries or a Taurus. I was also getting like, if this is not your mother as well, this could be their mother too. Somebody could have, somebody's mom could be in the middle of this shit or was having something to do with this as well. They could have definitely had their hand in some shit in the background. Somebody's going to have a seizure. Hard work is all I know. Struggle is for the week. I'm, I'm, get, I'm seeing you get off your ass for whatever that you got going on. Yeah, and these people is hyperventilating here, crying. Trying to come to some type of mutual agreement or discussion here within each other. These people are having some type of secret meeting. Are they negotiating what to do next or how to stop you or, or what's to come? Okay? How to get rid of you or how to get rid of a person. Okay? They go Pisces. Yeah, and then black eyes. For some of you guys, they want to hurt you, jump you. Okay? Or they want to split something down the middle. Um... They want to get rid of you. Fingers crossed behind the back. They want to come in and lie to you. This is the, the part of the negotiation to come in and lie to you. Yeah. I will fight for you and to jump you. So this pe these people want to come in and act like they got your back, okay? But then they want to set you up. It's like, no, nah, I'm here for you, Pisces. I got your back. Yeah, I'm here. I'll be here for you, girl. You can count on me to be strong. Somebody is abusive as fuck. Okay, somebody could be want to beat you up or uh, put their hands on you. This is a jealous ass man and mad because you get good. You got a lot of people find you to be attractive or you look very good or or they can't they can't you know what I'm saying? They, Cause you don't want them and shit. So they mad. They wanna they wanna punch on you and, and put their hands on you and all this kind of shit. But this motherfucker gonna end up in okay, cause I'm let me not say what I'm gonna say. This motherfucker gonna end up in mm, trying to fuck, trying to run around and put their hands on you. I did a reading like this. I did a reading like this for Gemini, and over on my other read, and I labeled it "Blood by Your Hands." If y'all wanna go check out over on my other channel, um, High Priestess Mar. It's blood by your hands, um, but it's your hands collective. It, it's giving me an energy of like somebody, but I was getting, I was getting like a masculine energy in there. But take it however it resonates, because this is definitely coming back to me. Somebody here gonna be trying to do some shit to you, and they gonna fuck around, and and, and it's not gonna end well for them. It ain't gonna end well for them because whoever this is, they're not protected. God is on your side. High power is on your side. Okay. Because you are the one being target. Oh, baby, look how I flipped out my hand. I'm telling you, I can't never make it up. Um, 911 Angelica Sisters, baby. Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, Gabriel, Uriel, Ariel, Joseph, Josephiel, and Zachiel. Okay? I'm getting like somebody here think they the big bad wolf. But then they gonna meet their maker. This is what it's giving. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Somebody could be trying to lure you or get you somewhere where they where they can hurt you or jump out the car on you and try to surround you or some weird stupid ass shit like that. That shit ain't gonna work. This is what they trying to do. This is what they negotiating. And when this is being said about, they are gonna be feeling some type of way because this is gonna be outed. Whether this is being outed now, or they're gonna hear about it from another uh, another tarot reader. Yeah, um, next twenty four hours, somebody could be trying to do something. Um, somebody name could be between the letters A and G. Okay, we got make a movie, write a book, ready to tell my TV, uh, ready to tell my story, and we got protect yourself here. I'm getting like whatever you're saying, you're gonna out these people. 
Okay, or somebody's going to be outing an individual or telling something. Now, somebody could be telling something to the authorities or telling something to you. In the next 24 hours about how somebody's coming towards you or how somebody's planning to do something, when they plan to do it, how they plan to do it, and what's going on. Now, how this individual know a cancer and in a week, something about a week or a week from now or this week. Now, how how this individual know? I don't know. Maybe they get in tarot readings. I don't know how the fuck they know. Let's see. Because we got to protect yourself. Somebody could literally be trying to warn you or this could be a warning right here. What is this? Yeah, Wheel of Fortune. It's faded. Something's faded here. Something's faded to happen. It's like somebody's walking into their own damn karma. It's like higher power already knew what somebody was going to do before they was going to do it. And so it's already been set up. Somebody literally finna walk, them, walk into a fucking trap. And it's on purpose. It's like somebody's sitting here and waiting. I'm hearing dynamite. I don't know. Literally dynamite. Like, boom. I don't know why I'm getting that. Like, fireworks. Like a big ass explosion. This can even be like a car blowing up. Or some type of tragedy. Five of Cups. Don't it look like she crying? Yeah, somebody finna regret the fuck out of this. I don't know what this is. It's like a funeral or something. This is giving me like a funeral. Like somebody going to a funeral. Five of Cups. Somebody finna be crying. Regretting some shit. Tower. I spit the deck. Tower. I can't make it up. Yup, King of Pentacles. A stingy ass King of Pentacles. That wanted to do everything for money. This is a wannabe. They wanted something here. Alright, there's a King of Pentacles that's involved. Wanted some type of fame and fortune. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. This is that and that this is that motherfucker that's gonna try to come towards you again with the Knight of Pentacles. That's gonna try to come towards you and act like they they um helping you, but they're not. Or some of you guys do have a Knight of Pentacles that's coming towards you though. It's two Knight of Pentacles, but it's one that's a fake ass Knight of Pentacles. That's this one. Okay. That wants you to um they, they really don't want to help you. They just want to leech on to you. And then you got a real Knight of Pentacles that's coming to bring you an ace. That, that somebody's trying to steal from you. Or they're trying to swap something so that you don't get it. Yeah, look. King of Cups. Yeah, somebody's a devil worshiper. Seven of Wands. You're defensive against this motherfucker too. Look at him all ugly and shit. You defensive against them, okay? Or, like I said, there's a king of cups that's involved in the situation, but I really feel like, like I said, vice versa. Take it however it resonates. But all the parts are not going to fit here. So just take whatever fits, okay, and leave the rest. But this is all I have for you guys. Thanks for chilling with your girl, her priestess, Mar. I appreciate all the love and support you guys have been showing to the channel. Thank you so very much. If this has touched you energetically in any kind of way, definitely go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. Hit that like button, that subscribe, hit that notification bell so that you're updated on the next videos. And I love you guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace, love, and prosperity. Till next time. Mwah. Bye.